With severe weather in our forecast again this week, we all have a lot of experience and knowledge about what to do if you're in a tornado polygon. But do you know how a tornado forms? This morning, Chief Meteorologist James Spann shows you. No doubt about it. Tornadoes are bad, but there is one good thing about them. They don't happen that often. It takes a certain set of circumstances for tornadoes to form. First off, you need moist, unstable air. That means air parcels tend to rise freely. Number two, veering winds with altitude. The wind changes direction from the surface to 18, 20,000 feet off the ground. And finally, a triggering mechanism, something to trigger thunderstorms like an approaching cold front or an upper trough. At the surface on tornado days, winds are typically out of the south to southeast. Aloft, the winds are out of the west, and that change in direction will typically start this horizontal rotation within a thunderstorm. And keep in mind, within a thunderstorm, updrafts are very powerful, especially on severe weather days, and those strong updrafts can tilt that to a vertical rotation, and if everything else is right, a tornado can form. Again, they don't happen that often, but you need to understand them and know what to do. It's all part of understanding the weather in Alabama.